So, uh, <coughs> welcome to The Walking Dead, episode 2, Star for Hell. Well, I couldn't find those episodes, and now I found it, of course, and I already played season 2, I think two episodes of The Walking Dead season 2. Um, um, yeah, so now I can play the season 1 episodes, so... Let's do that. But the episode 2 of season 2, I could not. I'm gonna tell you when I play season 2 later on. Um, so forget about season 2, I'm gonna play season 1, episode 2. Even if I have played 2 episodes of season 2 already, it's jumped over a lot of episodes. But time to play this. So I'm gonna play season 1, episode 2. Now I found the episodes. I know who you are. Can I jump over this? I guess not. You've been all by yourself through this? <laughs> yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're Lee and Kenny. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. Doug and you'll shift in with I saved Carly. <laughs> We reason with him. Oh, that's right. That's right. But was Duck really beaten? I don't know that. I don't know. Oh, that can kind of yerk. You watch your ass, damn it. Yes. And I forget to play those episodes. I'm sorry. <laughs> I found it now. Presents to you, Walking Dead. Here's Lee. So I'm Lee, of course. Three months later. Oh. Axing the zombie. Bye bye. The walker is dead. Still the act? No. Damn. What did get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> looks like a rabbit. Looks like a rabbit. I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Huh. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. No regrets at all. It's hardly a meal, Martha. I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Oh! That much, huh? Oh! I pushed the wrong number. <laughs> you think wrong you answer. That doesn't exist. I sure hope so. Sorry. The, lack of the first option I get, and I push the bottom that not exist. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Well, he's got a wife and son to look out for. And they're safest in a big group. Going out on his own will get them all killed. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. Rah, rah. Three. Larry's just uh, looking out for his daughter. Hey, I know Lily. She can take care of herself. He needs to take that energy and put it towards finding us some more food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker. Oh, yeah. He's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. 
And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. Huh. Knock me flat. And I'm gonna be a character who will die later on. Now what? Oh. It's a long shot. I'd hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. Shoot the bird? What are you doing with the bird? Is it food? You missed! You suck! Oh! See, was that Kenny? Someone screaming! What's happening? Ah. Ooh, Jesus who are they? Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get it. Get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to me, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Lee, this is fucked up. We gotta help you. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. Oh, Kenny. I, you look so young I, here. I don't care. Please. We gotta get him out of there. Oh God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta Come on. hurry. Hurry up. Hurry, please, hurry. Lee, oh. this trap has been altered. There's no release latch. Oh no. Here comes the walkers. Walkers. It's now or never, Lee. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Oh! You have to get him out. You this have bad. to. Really bad. Just get me out, please. Lee, do something. We're going to be surrounded so any minute. Bad. Please, get me out of this. Oh, Jesus, those things are going to be here soon. Hurry! Come on. One more time, Lee. You can do it. Let's go, let's Why is go. this Ah. Like There's gotta be something we can do. You're not cutting through that. There has to be a we way out of this. Now. He's got so much blood already. already. Please hurry up. I'm sorry. Damn it, Lee, just cut off his fucking leg. Just get me so out. We don't have time for that. My blood I'm sorry. We're gonna be surrounded any minute now. I want my leg. I want my leg. Oh, God. I'm, I'm so. I'm, I'm sorry, dude. Really bad. Just get me out. No, but I. Shit, shit. It's impossible. It locks I forgot. I get it. I have to. Come on. We gotta go. Now. Oh, come on. <laughs> no, no. Come. Come on. Come on now. <sighs> Can I begin all over again, please? Yes, yes. Okay. I think I got it this time. 
There's no release latch. <coughs> oh no. Shit. All right. Now we'll never leave. Please. Get me out of I'm going to help you this time. Get the boys, uh, I'm not going to Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Uh Do you think you can get it open? No, it did not help. All right. Uh. Why is this happening to us? No, no, no! Stop! Fuck! Oh Jesus! Those things are gonna. Well, I have no choice them to do this. I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. Oh! We don't have time for that. I'm sorry, but we have to go. Oh! I'm sorry, dude. Lee, I can't keep him back forever. One more time. Oh, come on! Don't let me do this. Him free, you passed out. He's alive, grab him and let's go. Behind you. I guess you're gonna die later on. Come on, come on, we gotta move. Uh oh, he's gonna, and he's gonna die. He died. Definitely dead. The walking Dead. Let's go. Star for hell. I'm hungry. I'm actually hungry too. Well, what should I eat? Hey, little clam! Corvy, duck. Oh, I don't like that dude. Yeah, can we just keep moving on with the? It's Lee and Kenny, Corvey, probably. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? They got wounded! Oh my god! What happened? Oh, what is going on? have time to explain. Lee. Are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. <laughs> Lee, are you okay? Lee, I don't know. Clementine Leslie. What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? We have, have to. Calm down for a fucking hey, minute. No, I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. He would have died if we left him. So what? We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group. Right here, right now. Well, I'm saving your man. Come on. People yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. Yeah. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine. You guys fight it out then. Welcome to the family. Come over here and see what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything mm. always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part <coughs> of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. 
Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around. But now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens no, next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide whose side you're on. Great. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? <laughs> oh my god, I hope you die. Maybe he did. He just sees him. Do you think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food. But nobody else wants to. Because they don't trust anyone and they're all afraid. Today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. I couldn't say who was right, Lily or Kenny, because... I only have four food items for ten hungry people. Great. Ken or Lily said... I don't know what I was. Maybe I just, just took Kenny's side there. Because Kenny was right about something. I was thinking about something else. Okay. And here I am. Um. Walking around like a silly man. And I don't have so much food. Well, the gear to have something to keep them occupied. Yeah. I wanna. Yay! I, I wanna meet Clem. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Yes. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Oh man, I want to talk to Clem more. I'm not giving you food, but I'm gonna talk to you. Hey, is my friend gonna make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. There was no other way. So who are you people? Our group's gonna want to know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The man okay. who saved is Mr. Parker, the band director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs when... Ben when Paul. ...everything happened. Alright then. Bye bye. Thanks. We'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. I'm gonna talk to you. Why would I give you food? You, uh... Okay. Sleeping any better? No. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. <laughs> Drugstore? Yeah. <laughs> Drugstore. What should I do? I'm giving out food. What should I do? I'm giving... A bit. Backing a bit. I'm giving food later on. Talk to Kenny. Hi, Kenny. What's up? Words getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. Coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. Okay. All right, Kenny. Um. 
I shall talk to Doc. Yeah. Hey, Doc. How about a little food? What do you like? A pebble jerky or how about crack and cheese? Crack, bitter, uh, what? Crackers and cheese? Kexo, okay. Here. Yeah! Oh man, I'm so hungry! I'm gonna give you food too. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. I'm giving you the same. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. A Sunday? Huh? Okay. If you say so. If you say so. Um, I'm gonna walk to this lady over here. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Sure. Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this. Sewing up people's injuries. Okay. I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Blaine, this man has no leg. It's what your husband wanted. <laughs> Figures. I love that man to death, but I swear sometimes he's dumber than a bag of hammers. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on Ugh. the others. I need a little space here anyway. Blood everywhere. Okay. Well, I guess I'm gonna give everyone food then. If that's the case. So... I'm gonna give Kenny one. If he needs it. Want something to eat? Again, Apple. No. Whatever. Okay, I give you food then. Want something to eat? Oh! 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 Wait. I pushed it. I pushed the exit on the wrong bottom. Here, Kenny, take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Hey. Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. They know this. Keep wait. Keep the last piece of food for yourself, or save the last piece of food for someone else. Oh, but Lee, he's a loyal, nice guy. He's gonna save the last piece of food for someone else. Uh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Yeah. So that's you then. How's it going, Lee? From up here, it looks like oh. you're playing favorites. Uh... I talk to you then. Uh, it's a nice place, but I want to move on because this is adventure. Maybe we should think about leaving the motel. God, not you too. I know Kenny wants to leave. I think that's why he's so eager to get the RV working. But this is a good spot. We're protected, we're close to the drugstore, we have a routine now. Yeah, but this is gonna be a... For now. We should talk about you and Kenny. What about us? They're arguing. It's getting pretty out of hand. You know people notice that. 
Look, I'm working my ass off to make sure we have a good setup here, and Kenny just doesn't appreciate that. All we need is food. But there is no food. You know that better than anyone. Well, we'll just have to find some. Well, I give you some. Here. I don't want anything from you. Fine. And I give it to Carly then. She needs food. Want something to eat? Here. Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? I'm okay. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. No. I know I said Thank it you. didn't matter why you <laughs> saved me instead of Doug, but... You don't owe me anything, Carly. Don't know nothing. Now what? I will talk to Clam. That thing doesn't work anymore, does it? No, not since it broke at the drugstore. Oh. Just gonna hold on to it then? Yeah, if that's okay. I, um, I need it. It's okay, hon. You said they'd find us. I know, I did. And until then... Look, uh, Clementine... I'm not stupid, Lee. I know it's just pretend. But it makes me feel better. Okay, you take good care of it then. I will. <laughs> How you doing, Clementine? Everything all right? Yeah. Is that man going to be okay? He'll be fine. He'll be fine. Oh, that's good. Okay. Uh, now what? Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Uh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. What's happening? Am I gonna talk to this? I talk to Mark. Hey, you holding up okay, Lee? I was pretty fucked up back there, having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah, I just hope Kaja can save him. Lily's pretty pissed at us. Listen, I know her intentions are good. <coughs> nothing. She's making the smart choice. Those parasites you guys brought back need to go. You ever miss the Air Force Base? I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely overrun. Should I give him food? Or should I give the guy... We met for some food. Uh, you uh. Help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Uh, I'm giving it to Mark. Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? Because, well, I don't like you. Cut Lee some slack. He knows you're just out to protect Lily. He told me so. Just like he's trying to protect Clementine. He... Oh, I just need some food. Going this long without a proper meal make anybody cranky. Alright, well, I give you food down. If you shut the fuck up. Here, Larry. Lily would want you to keep your strength up. That girl needs to quit worrying about me so much. Oh, I made a tough choice. Just seeing the food is driving me crazy. Not such an easy job, is it? I don't 
don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. <coughs> I'm serious. There's no you. food left for today. More than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. No choices. Okay. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... Let him go, Katja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. Yeah. Man, Brock, I tried. Give him a break. Give everybody a break. No problem anymore. Give everybody a break. Whoa! I wasn't prepared for that. I didn't need to... Oh my! I didn't have the time to answer any oh, options. Thanks. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get Why are you gonna home? call me no. asshole? Who's you talking for yourself? Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word. But he wasn't bitten, I swear. Well, your not bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife. What? What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. God help us. God help us. It makes sense. In those first few days, it spread so fast. Car accidents, suicides, everything was making more of them. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym, and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning, and... God. Back off! Uh -oh. Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we... We just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Carly. Are you armed? Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But, uh, I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by... At least the one who gets in charge. generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look at we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. We don't have any food. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out, see if it's legit? I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what do y'all think? Okay. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. Yes. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. So Good one, Lee. Good one. You guys really have foods? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese. <laughs> and, uh, and with the vegetables we grow, we got... Yeah. It's nice yeah. to have in that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. 
Me, the leader? I think they'd want me for a leader. Sure, everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Yeah. It doesn't matter. You've got to let go of that guilt. The Lee I know is a good man. Yes, he's a good man. I might know. He was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I lied to her, but... What exactly did happen with the senator? Oh. Well, I'm here whenever you want to talk. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, I really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? I am. I am. You guys have any questions? You come to me. How many people you got over there anyway? Well, the kid here is our newest arrival, but we're all looking forward to some food. We really need it. Well, here's to helping each other out. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got. Of course, I avoid. Quite frankly, we can I don't. Use an extra I don't know those people. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's. You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit. Uh -huh. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Carrie are always fucking this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who are they? Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. And you guys were keeping it there's up. There's only two of them. Oh no, there's yeah, a lot you know what? more. We ate it all. What are you going to fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out. I hope they move on. Fuck yeah. you. Oh. Oh. Now he's dead. Jesus. Asshole. The world out here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Bye bye. Give me the food, supplies, and everything. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. Uh-huh. The fence keeps them out? You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that. Generators and amps. Uh-huh. I assume that's a lot. Accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of looks like the farm from Macon. From... They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at from the hotel. The... Oh my goodness, that place is terrible. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? We all work together. Plus we've got found three options sometimes before. Experience. I accidentally push four when it's not on the tree. <laughs> Get empty. Hold on, I, I thought you said oh. someone else was running things. <clears throat> oh yeah. Um... I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. We're all 
incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Oh. Big fresh this morning. Amazing. Like I said, pushing the four bottle, there's only three bottles. Uh oh, two options there. Oh my god. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. Yes, please. It'll be we nice want to have food. some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Okay. Bye bye, Carly. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generator before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh, man, that fence. If we play our cards right... How did how did Lee meet Mark? <laughs> so how do you want to play this? Let's make sure the place is safe. Uh, we should do whatever we can to help out. Yes. They're offering us food. We should do whatever we can to make these people like us. The way Brenda was talking, I get the feeling like she'd be happy to have us stay. All the more reason for us not to fuck this up. If Andy needs some help securing the perimeter, then that's what we do. Yes. So I'm gonna walk around now? Of course I am. Uh, speak to Mark again, I guess. So what's your read on Andy so far? Think they'd be open to letting us stay? Getting the perimeter secured is going to help us a lot. We'll be getting in good not, and making not much safe. of and of um, choice for an option. <laughs> okay, I'm walking this way then. Should I help him? Well, your name is Andy. Andy, talk to Andy. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Been stockpiling, huh? Two. Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Okay. Pay attention. You never know. Let's help them out then. Going out. And I'm tired. St. <laughs> John's to like us? Well, we don't want to seem over anxious. Showing them we can handle this fence is going to go a long way. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. He wouldn't be such a pain in the ass if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. I, I'm, I'm sorry. All right. We'll work it out somehow. Well. Hopefully he'll calm down once he's out here. There's one. Gross. Nice. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Right. Looks 
like he's stuck. Yeah. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Okay. Now. I didn't go right up the arrow first. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. Can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? The fortress needs people to defend it. We've got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's all. Thanks. Well, thanks, Mark. There's another one. I appreciate your backup. Another one. Maybe someone you knew, <laughs> someone you know, or not. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> Nope. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Would have been nice to get some it's of It's a colorful, peaceful too, you know. area over here. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're going to be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? Hopefully. If got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Hopefully. Hopefully they have food. I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> okay. I got you. Little help here, Lee? Oh. Oh, <laughs> always pushing the wrong button. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Oh! No! Mark! What the? Get to the gate! Get down! You asshole! Jesus! Who says that? We had an agreement. I guess you misunderstood us. Get to the gate using the track tractor's cover. We cover it up. Oh! What happened? Shit! It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. I'm gonna have to move. All right. Move it. Keep going. Another one. Come on. How many of those things did we push down? Give it the food. Don't think I can't 
Oh! Don't bite me! You okay? Yeah. Yeah. Come on. The gate's right there. Oh shit. Bye bye, moron. You sound like Larry. Why am I pushing? Why am I over there? I was about to say what? something. Oh my god, what happened? Oh. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just. I can't be quiet if someone asks me what's happening and when danger comes. You. Freaking. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. Maybe it isn't as safe here as we thought. Look, we're sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? <laughs> They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come and find us. Come and find us. Bandits? <coughs> serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. Hope you kids like swings. A swing! I love swings! Just like at my treehouse! Come on, Doc! Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah! Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. Oh! Great! I'm walking around again. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Uh. Open. Can I go in here? If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in ships. But I wanted to. Okay. I could not go in there now. Keep on. No. Guess not. Lots of hay. Enough of these might work as adequate cover for arrows, if that becomes a problem. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go up there, I guess. Can I walk faster? Larry. 
Uh, well, it's gonna be trouble now if I will talk to her. I was supposed to leave her, your daughter alone. Well, I can't talk to you, but well, okay, I'm going this way then. Oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but yeah. he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything, but gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Hey, thanks for backing me up this morning at the motel. I know I came down on you guys pretty hard, but you do agree with the way I'm running things, right? Yeah. You're a good leader, Lily. Kenny's too emotional, but his intentions are in the right place. Still, it'd be best for all of us if you two could try to work together once in a while. Yes. Okay. So, uh, guess I'm done talking with you. I can't walk any faster. Great. So, I'm going... Here now. That thing keeps a fence electrified. Yeah. If a couple of tools out in the open is as unsafe as it gets, we'll be fine here. Would have been nice to have one of these back at the motor end. Mm-hmm. But they go through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. Yeah. Oh, I can walk up here. No, hey! There's some kids! Oh, screw that. Fellas? How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. Can we have the food yet? I'm hungry. Do some recon. And we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So, are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Okay. Yeah, we gotta work together on this. Those bandits are a danger to everybody. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. But I wanna eat. We're doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Oh, I need a cute clown. Yeah. I know it's around here. It's got to be close. Here. Oh shit, you found it? Am I gonna shoot? Oh, Jesus. Really? Sneak up to the camp. Someone's gonna cut me. Something is gonna cut me up. You see anybody? Looks empty. Looks empty. 
Maybe they are. I'm gonna check out the tin. They will come back here, probably. There's some key there or something. Or empty. Or nothing. Don't die now. Camp's too small. It can't be there. When I look around for food, that's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably <coughs> around here they stole from us. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna look around. I'm looking. Come dear that way. Empty. Great. Nothing. Nothing. Okay then. Something in this box. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. <coughs> the first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Uh huh. We don't know whose camp this is. Might not be bandits. It must be. They don't share their neighborhood. <laughs> Boxes from the dairy here. Probably food we can get them. Fuckers cross the line. Looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid sized. Okay. Cattle. Just water. Used water. Okay. Now what? Bottles. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Uh huh. Trash. Yuck! I don't need that. Uh. What else? I've looked for everything now. Looks like they expected to be here a while. Camera. You find? I didn't see that. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but that's uh. all on a regular trading schedule. Lily. I thought you were running things back there. Yeah, yeah but uh, uh, she's got the combat training. Right, I got an axe and a camera. And now what? <sighs> Gas can. Nothing but fumes. Shit. Okay then. Well then, I don't know either. Well, I've been everywhere now. To be honest. After Wanna look at the tent, how it looks. Oh, wow. Wow. 
Wait, I'm gonna go in the tent. Clementine's hat. Oh. Guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are, and I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We had a deal. You uh, broke it first. We're looking for the people who attacked the dairy. Yeah, uh, Shut yeah, my okay. Friend. I don't know where they are, but they ain't here. So get the fuck out of my camp. She's lying, Lee. Now maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice soft arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what you want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'ma head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Put down the crossbow. No, sir, I need it. I need it to kill you fuckers. <laughs> Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind. Oh! God damn it! You straight up murdered that woman. Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. <sighs> it's a clean shot. Oh, we're gonna get in trouble. The forehead. Of course, I did not choose to shoot Still, her. Why? Why would I shoot her? So, that's it. I guess some went with a monster. If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Oh, come on. What is this? Why? Oh, you son of a... Was a hell of a ride, huh? Jeez, Can I get some food now? You ain't getting soft on Maria. Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. <sighs> this isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody, then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. Oh, now awesome. they're gonna fight again. Great. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Uh, don't mind them. It's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. Yeah, give it some food. We'll fix that shortly. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lassie. Really? 
Really? Clementine. I'll put up with, uh, I wanna give you the hat. Okay. Um. Now keep play. I'm not gonna end the episode right now. I, mean, I, was, I just wanna go and give the Clementine hat. And maybe I'm ending the episode. And start all, all over again. Yeah, go in there and give Clementine your hat. Or her hat. So it's over. Come on. Okay, uh, kids. Oh, a cow. What a big cow. Holy okay, macaroni. You can pet her. It's okay, go ahead. <laughs> Whoa! Katya says Mabel could have a baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. <laughs> What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. <laughs> Did you lick it? <laughs> 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 Give the hat. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. Do you think you'll ever have kids? <laughs> I don't think so, Clem. It's not the way the world is now. I just... Uh, I don't think I could do that. Oh. Maybe when the world gets better, then. Maybe. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Okay, talk to Andy. There, Andy. Yep. Uh, I want food. Um, when do you think uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Okay, let's ask her. We met this guy in him. the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he uh. He probably talks a little more than he ought to. Okay. Thanks. Yep. Doc. Have I missed anything? No, not really. Hmm, it smells funny in here. Like manure. What's manure? Duty. <laughs> Kids. <laughs> Good one, I didn't say shit. Because then when Clementine we said shit. I'm gonna. Wait, I can open those? Oh, nice. Great. Go back. I'm not quitting this video until I get some uh, food. I like this. I like to see what they have in the, the door. Maybe they have zombies. It's so weird going to a stranger's house and just walking and looking. It 
it's a feeding trough. Yeah. Go back. Wait, I can use that door too? You found it too, huh? <laughs> can it? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff. Something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. <laughs> I've got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, the guy with Kachina, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is, we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. Yeah, use your head. Professor, <laughs> what you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. <sighs> Uh... Hey, Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban? <laughs> what? I'm not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. <laughs> hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly inside and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened all right sounds like you got a plan i'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow Andy. okay Shit, i thought that was danny whatever can i help you boys find something uh just checking out the barn here never been to a dairy farm before just don't roam around without me or Danny. I made an excuse. <laughs> you know, the bandits and all. Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Oh, I'm scratching my neck. Okay. Distract Andy to get him out of the bar. Okay. Distract him. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Okay, now. Now we go. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Oh, fuck. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. You got a screwdriver? For what? Uh, uh, never mind. Wait. Alrighty then. Wait. I need to find something. Talk to Kenny. Distracting Andy, but he keeps coming back. There's got to be something out there you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. What about those generators? The generators? Okay. I'm going out. The generators. What's happening? Oh. How does a woman like yourself run this whole Larry, place? are you flirting with this woman? Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. 
The generators. The generators. That one. A screwdriver for this. Okay. Dunder and dunder way. <sighs> Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. Oh shit. Damn it. I need a screwdriver. Where can I find a screwdriver? Dan Danny, do you have a screwdriver? Hello. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. You really like that girl. What's not to like? It's just a gun. That's where you're wrong. This is Charlotte. She's as faithful as a starving hound when you got a bone in your pocket. Do you have... do you going... I'm gonna go wait for supper there. It'll be a good one. Do you... do you have sex with that gun too? I better go upstairs. Maybe... the woman has... no, where the screwdriver is in her home. We'll, uh, we'll finish talking later. You been getting along with Larry? <laughs> he just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? Uh, don't know if I would have used those words exactly. Don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity every now and then. So, what are y'all keeping the barn back there? Besides cows, I mean. Well, someone's getting a little curious, aren't they? I don't mean to pry. It's nothing interesting, I can promise you that much. Just some odds and ends. Takes a lot to run a farm, you know. Ask her for a screwdriver, no? How's Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He can definitely teach them a thing. Wait, Mark was your boy? I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. We ran into some trouble out there. I'm just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. Before she died. We met a woman out there at her camp. She wasn't one of those bandits. Sounded like they did something pretty bad to her. And your marauders are still out there. I think all them folks out in the woods had drug problems. What does that have to do with anything? Means you can't trust them. Any of them. Think I'll go have a look around. Kinda peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. Yoing outside for a walk through the downer. Oh man, I want the screwdriver. But how? The kids are not playing. Wait, maybe I should go call Carl over there. Yeah. They're storing gasoline all over the property. Yeah. Uh. We. Uh, 
Oh great. Again. Carly, do you, uh, I mean Lily. Your name is Lily. Lily? What's going on, Lee? Do you have a Do you have a screwdriver? Whatever you do, just be careful. Yeah, we don't want to fuck this whole thing up. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here. We don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, maybe it was not the thunder, it's the wind. But I'm starting to it's, think it friend sounds over like thunder, but it's just the wind. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up. It looks like the show. wind is outside here, but it's here. Um, should we talk about Daddy? No. Go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Oh wait. Larry, do you have a screwdriver? Looks like you're getting along with Brenda pretty well. You know, for a nice change of pace, how about you try and mind in your own fucking business? I should have not talked to you then, of course. You freaking moron. So So how do I so how do I found the so, hey. Yeah. Didn't you have an arrow? An axe. Aren't I supposed to look for a screwdriver? Oh, hold on. In the box there, I did not see that. I didn't think about that. Yes. Take that. It's gonna borrow this for a second. Uh, borrow that. Here we go. children wait I'll make an excuse for you get that thing off yes I will thank you Kenny for your support um, all right that's one 
No. Screws holding it. Ah. If I can remove them, I don't even need to deal with the lock. That's two. Yeah, they're getting slowly here. No. Screws holding it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, stop talking the same and repeat all over again. That's it? What is it? What? Whoa! Didn't you hear the bell? Whoops, I'm caught. Why was there so much blood in there? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it. And I got a back bad back. feeling about Mama this now. Mama like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, <sighs> nothing to worry about. Okay, if you say so. So Andy came back anyway. Nobody closed the door. Whoa! What was that? <laughs> Lee, get back. <laughs> Excuse me, miss. We had to block the back door after Walker got upstairs. Don't. <laughs> yes, time for dinner. I'm hungry. Now go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Ah. Now don't you worry about him. Oh, where's Mark? You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Okay. Go to the... What did you... Was it here? Dirty bathroom. I didn't... I didn't read what she... What she said. Oh, keep going. Uh, I guess you're not gonna wash your hands. That's the bedroom. Farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. Is that blood? Probably. Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. Yeah. Someone needed some first aid recently. Candles. Smart. Musty as hell. Who do they need so much morphine for? Okay. Back down. I can't walk through that door. Okay, I'm uh, going down there. What? What's that? Feels like there's a storm coming. Uh, farm books, no. cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. I heard something. I forget. What? Help you? Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, 
same name? What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? Come on, stop talking. Do do this thing. Collect this. Someone needs your help. Is it you, Mark? What the hell? How do I? Huh, where is that cord going? Yeah. Where is it going? Follow the lead. Oh God. Hello. Bookshelf. I was here before. I, I was thinking I could move this, but I couldn't before. Whoa. Kidnapped? Is it you, Mark? With no leg. It's you. It's Mark. What happened, Mark? Brothers. What the hell happened to your legs, man? Don't eat dinner. Don't eat dinner. Don't eat the dinner. <gasps> shit! 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 shit. Sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee. What's gotten into you? He just had a stalk. He could use some goddamn manners. Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's what crazy. The hell? You're scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. <sighs> There's nothing wrong with you. Mom, I was eating that. Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true, Blake. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. And I was hungry and wanted food. How I raised my boss. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. Just let us go. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna <sighs> die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Clementine, run! Nobody's going anywhere. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the what? The fucking black. Put fuck. your guns down. We're walking You're out of here. Near my fucking Mommy, family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay. <gasps> Lee, Lee. No, 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 no. Let go of her, you son of a bitch! Mark?
fucking bastards. I see Clementine. to make us eat a person but you didn't do it no the rest of us did god damn it if you hadn't dragged your feet come on dad now's not the time what happened the man hit you they threw us in the meat locker we we gotta get out of here if they so much as touch my family i'll kill those sons of bitches get us out you sons of bitches dad okay larry lily clementine and lee we four are trapped here Scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out. Where is Carly? Oh man. I have to do something. Shelves are pretty sturdy. We could climb up. Uh, but there's no way out through the ceiling. Come on, try yourself. Don't want to know what kind. There's more of us on the way. Let us out now. Do you want to live? Be a hole Not behind these help. pallets. We have to go out from here. We have to go out. No such luck. They're not gonna open the door. You, you think a fucking apocalypse gives you the right to chop people into? Have to talk to everyone about this. Dad. Okay. I'm talking to you. Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking no. door! No! We're gonna make... Uh, we're gonna make a decision here. Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, easy! Oh no, oh no, oh no. Is it the heart attack? Oh no. No. Dad, come on! Dad! Oh shit. Well, he get he's about to die. He's dead. He's not dead. What has to happen, Lee? Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel. How fast he turned. What are you saying, Lily? I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're going to be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you. We can bring him back, Lee. Uh. Keep him from coming back. No! God damn it! Well, if anything in person, it's human beings. We can't kill him if he's not dead, Kenny. You remember how hard it was for you to get that monster off of Katya? And Larry's twice his size. It's him or us. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. I can't destroy the brain. You did a hell of a heart attack. He, he, he was not beaten by a zombie. Come on. I'm helping Lily. Wake up. Lee! Is he breathing at all? No, no, I don't Of course I'm helping Lily. He had a heart it's a human being. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn! Whoa. You're putting all of us at risk, Freeze. you son of a bitch! Whoa, you're fucking worthless. Fuck. No! Kenny, what the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. Uh, 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 uh. I was helping her! I know. Don't you... Touch me. Oh no. Are you okay? Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad, don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? 
you found a way out? I'm working on it. Oh, Kenny, you stupid moron. Sure, for sure, but he was trying to keep us safe. Bullshit. He cares about keeping his family safe. He doesn't give a shit about you and he me. He puts his family first, sure, just like Larry did. Oh, well, that was a good conversation. Ah, oh, can't hear more on. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, We've got to have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. Look, if we're going to survive this shit, we've got to work together. How do you expect Lily to work with us after what she just saw you do? If she wants to live, she'll work with us. If she doesn't, then the hell with her. So what now? Uh, something up here. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, uh, a rock won't help. A coin. You got a rock? Do you have a coin? Yeah, I need something. I need screws, but how? Where? When? I mean. Yeah, but how? It's not coming off that way. Okay, well then I don't know. Talk to Kenny again. Listen, I need a coin or something. It's important. It could get us out of here. Well, I got nothing. Damn it. Please, I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. I know Larry would die. About him. I didn't like him that much. This is a terrible time. But I don't want people Back to die. Morning. Larry. Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Okay, then. Sorry, oh, Lily. Boy. Sorry, Larry. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? No. 
but I have to try that one. The ring. My mother's. Don't worry, I'm not taking it. Here we go. Two quarters and a dime. All right. All right. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit. Yeah, you. Yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't think about that. Can you do that in real life? You uh, think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. All right. She made it. Are you okay? Did anyone see you? No, but there's a man outside. Where the hell okay. are you What do you care? Kenny! Kenny, you moron! Lily, I'm sorry. We gotta go. I know. I just need a minute to say goodbye. Hey, we're good. Okay? all killed stay here take care of Lily okay I will We came into this. Oh. So you were kidnapped in that place. Take that one, it's good. <laughs> Unnecessary. God, what's wrong with these people? So that's what they did to Mark, huh? This room would give anybody nightmares. Okay, I changed it. Put your people. Sick bastards. All of them. Right. What the hell do you think you're doing? Getting my family back. What are you gonna do? Walk up and grab his gun? Good a plan as any. Ah, oh, can't even more on. Well, there's the gun. Maybe he will see me. What are you doing outside the barn? Oh shit! Just going in the place like you said. Sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. What's he doing out there? 
Mama says we I can't keep that know. many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. What should we do? Do you have a weapon? Yeah, good. Not the kid. Keep it simple. As soon as he passes, afraid. jump in from behind. See what he's doing now. Oh, I know, Mother. This is Lee, my favorite focus. part, too. Where's Danny? When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> you never even look down. Can you see? <sighs> yeah. Lee, talk to me. I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. See where he is now. Whoa! He saw us! Jesus Christ! Yeah, come on, Lily! Yeah! It's a sick bastard! I believe you're the most sickest guy in this family. What? Come on, run guys. Yeah. Yeah. You see, really? You understand now, don't you? He can have me. It's Why would I kill him? He might be a psychopath, but I'm not I'm not a murderer. I want I wanna kill walkers. It's not the answer! Aren't the walkers eating enough of us? You gotta keep me alive! If you kill me, the meat gets tainted! You can't eat it! You're already tainted! You ain't gonna kill me! Just like you didn't kill Jolene! You don't have what it takes! <laughs> Fucking Shoes God. down his face! This is not how the world works now! You won't Why would I kill you? I didn't see the other options then, but I choose it. Yeah, at least not a murderer. He only kills walkers. I'll cover you. Just stay here and keep Clementine safe. I'll be right back. Uh, uh. Kenny. Kenny, where did you go? We have to go up to the house, right? Uh, am I supposed to walk now? Can he can he shoot you? Oh great, a walker. Carly. Carly. Me? Ow. Shh. Is everyone okay? You guys have been gone way too long. Let's... We need your help. When you guys didn't come back, I figured something was up. What can we do? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Doc and Katja in the house. And I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right. We're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. So you didn't come with us. You would. Of course, we left you behind there. I was just thinking, where did Carly go? But it was Lily who was with us. Oh, um. Uh, time for walking! And no talking. 
A little less conversation, a little more action, please. A little less conversation, a little more action, please. Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? Uh oh. Yeah. Yeah, it's me. It's me. Uh oh. Lee, hit back! Don't come in here! You just had to go snooping around, didn't ya? Go, Brenda! Let the kids go! No, don't kill Candice, girl! Don't kill Candice, wife! I have to walk! No answer options to save her. Stop right there, I mean it. <gasps> what? Shooter. I don't wanna kill you, Lee. Please don't make this any worse. Just stop. Are you gonna get killed by a zombie? <laughs> Hell yeah. No, 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 no. Ah! Oh. Can I get shot? Who the fuck do you people think you are? We? You brought this on yourself. No, uh uh, you did this. All we wanted was a little gas to keep ourselves safe. Yeah! Come on, come on, come on. Oh my god. Oh, shit. Oh. Man, that's hurting. Doing it, I'm doing it. Come on, I'm pushing it. Yes, thank you. I think it's over now, Lee. Is that all you got, Lee? <laughs> you 
Oh yeah. It's over. It's sober. Fuck you. As soon as Danny Mama get out here. Well, your mama is bitten by a zombie. Well, they're not coming. They're not coming. What do you mean? Lee? What the fuck do you mean? Uh, Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Oh, I walk. We walk away from you. Get back here and finish this, Lee! Finish? Oh, uh, no. Uh uh. Walk away. Walk away. Get back here and fight me like a man, Lee. Lee! <coughs> bye bye. Lee is a sparing guy. They're getting in. Ooh. And Ed is gonna die go. by walkers. So does it mean this episode is over now? Pretty good episode. Thanks. We all survived. Except for Mark, unfortunately. Hey Lee, I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people for food? Yeah. We should have known something was up. How the hell did we foresee that? Come on, Lee. I don't know. I really don't. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. Okay. Are you okay, Kenny? You got shot. How are you doing? I'll be fine. Uh. Just not as young as I used to be. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? You destroyed this group, Kenny. There's no coming back from it. I did what nobody else would. Everything's gonna be different now. Maybe I wish you talk, you keep Larry, but I don't know. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Stay close, little clown. Those bad people dead. We didn't kill them, so I don't know. They might have been able to get away from the walkers, but I'm sure they won't be coming after us. That's good. Hey, Dad. I don't know what to answer anymore. Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. Good people. Hopefully. There is a car. We're here to help. Hopefully, it's not them. Attack us. 
maybe they were the good guys and not those who, who we was with those who attacked us thought we were the killers Figures. I got, oh, the, I got the key baby you gotta see this what is it load of food, and food? Back here. yay I think about food and guns maybe food this food could save all of us take the food Not all of us <sighs> Larry <laughs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead if they come back then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives this stuff isn't ours dad whose car is it don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? What if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? You're right. You're right. We shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. Clementine and I don't want any part of this. We're starving. Suit yourself. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Okay, what have we got in here? Look, there's more food in that box. They have antibiotics. What else do they have? See if there's any water. Here. I'm always in Clementine's side. Got it. But you could share with us some if you wanted. Hey, but uh, here. Could probably even... fit Clementine. No. She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. It's gonna get cold out eventually. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Oh God, Lee, you're gonna want to see this. What is it? Oh shit! I want to see. Can he? Lee. Iron Max. Somebody's filming us. Jake, Bart, Linda, and all y'all fucking sickos from the save lot. They call y'all bandits, but you're fucking rich. Oh, darling, baby, look at you. Look at you. Oh, you need a mama, sweetheart. We won't let them bandits get you, will we? No. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If you're I'll thinking find it, you're I'll safe, you know. sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you gotta be afraid of. The people I used to call friends. People who just... The woman who can get that. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I promise. Wow. The episode is over. Whoa. The end of the clip. This place nice. Is done. It's time to move on. Oh, man. Not like you ever listened to a damn word I said. Is this all you got? I've told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? Kenny with his mustache. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phases. Season two, now. we got beer. We need to get to the coast. <laughs> get him out of all this madness. Oh. Well, he's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you did. <laughs> Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. 
This is crazy. I'm the one keeping this group going. We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else. Whew. Uh, shop Davis leg off. Yes. Shoot violin. We let Danny shoot her. Help kill Larry. A lot of us didn't help Larry. Wait, helped kill Larry. Hold on. I did help Larry with a with his heart attack. But he died anyway. Killed both of the son John's brother. We didn't kill the brothers. Stole from stole food from the car. Forty four place did not steal. Wow. Well, I was just doing like Clementine said, but okay. All right, there was Walking Dead season one, episode two. Thanks for enjoying me. Bye bye.